where architects get the job wrong, it's when houses can become too prescriptive. In my view, a house should be a backdrop that stimulates life rather than dominates it. My name is Jonathan Tucky. I'm a designer in London. We are in a house that I designed for me and my family 20 years ago. It was a change of use from a light industrial building to a residential building. When we started, we didn't really know what family life would entail. The house was pretty much conceived before our children were, but we knew that we wanted to provide a degree of structure to the building, spaces that were dark, spaces that were light, different proportion spaces with different characters that would allow a family of different characters to accommodate it. What was a delight about this main space was this exposed brickwork, which we knew immediately we saw it, we loved. We thought that that was gonna have a richness and patina, but also tell us the story of the building that we had started with. London has got to be one of the best places on earth. Its diversity, its richness is so energising. But I think you can be somewhat alienated from core elemental senses. We were very committed to make sure that those elemental aspects of life, of our planet, were brought right into the house. The courtyard house was always inspiring bringing a garden into the middle of the house was going to enrich our lives, bring some degree of civility to the view from the kitchen, the view from the table, but equally the view from our bedrooms. Having had 20 years here, it's provided that canvas for me and the family to grow up. Now that my daughters are pretty much leaving the house and at university and it's coming the end of their time here, it's certainly done that for us over the last 20 years.